really, really shouldn't have told her. I feel like this is gonna end badly. Elise! What are you doing? What do you think she's doing? Elise, slow the fuck down! Wait for me! Move! Oh, here we are at Leal again. What was that about? Honor. Francois Germain was my father's lieutenant. What? Yeah. He was cast out of the order when I was a girl. Something about heretical notions or Jacques de Molay, I'm not entirely sure. But he should be dead. He died years ago. Did anyone tell him that? I there was, was a sage then, and now he's been. Oh! So would I. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! Investigate the workshop. So wait. Empty. Oh, what? Upstairs. That's where his workshop was. Tall, grey hair, eyes two different colours. All right, perhaps it is the same Germain. Ooh. This looks way too familiar. This is his workshop. Looks like no one's home. Or maybe he saw us coming. doing oh fuck oh no <laughs> ow oh, right. well what the fuck just happened there all right whoa why don't you just calm the hell down woman are you all right it is you could calm down a little bit now they're dead okay well that was bracing just like that time in Marseille a bit more blood this time around hmm there's nothing here he must have known his bluff wouldn't hold up so we've lost him again. Maybe not. Let's keep looking. Oh, so that's what they were talking about. <laughs> and the, that, that little clip was in the 101 trailer. Locked. Maybe we could... Kick it open? Do that. <laughs> wasn't exactly subtle, though. I'm sure he heard that if he's here. Well, now I know why this wasn't on the official tour. Oh, no. Ooh, look at the banners. Look. It's him. The bastard killed my father. I knew it! We have to tell Mirabeau. <sighs> Pick up the controller again. I'll take care of this. Meet me at Mirabeau's estate. Yes, ma'am. All right. Oh, what? Are you kidding me? Stay down. Francois Thomas Germain. Oh, you, you son them. of... The window. Beach. That's one. Watch out! I'm watching out, woman. You think I'm in cover for? Pew. Oh, that guy saw me. Really? I hit right trigger, not left trigger. But okay. Hit. Oh, don't shoot me. Oh, that hurt. Hiya. Okay, now I need to get upstairs. Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, I suggest you step away from this man immediately. Thank you! Alright. Yeah! Now the last one is right over here. Just didn't want to go quite so far down, but okay, I'll roll with it. Hello! <laughs> That's my first ledge kill. Awesome! Jesus Christ, dude. Alright. I got two headshots. I don't care. 
Yay! Sequence seven! What the hell? Do you copy? What? Good bloody work out there. You found him. Francois Thomas Germain. Grandmaster of the Templars and a sage to boot. By our reckoning, that's the second sage to rise to the Templars' highest rank. Uh -oh. Troubling trend. Until we know more about this Germain, stick with Arnaud. He might have outlived this Grandmaster, and that could lead us to his body. Bishop out. So, is this the whole Darkness of- Darkness of saint -Denis. It's the name of one of my fan arts. The, uh, Dead King's DLC. Uh, I don't know. I mean, when we were watching or slash playing the tragedy of Jacques de Molay, as de Molay was being burned at the stake, he was telling, uh, King Philip that, uh, his whole bloodline will be cursed. I'm thinking that might have something to do with the Dead King's DLC. But I don't know. It could be Jermaine. I'm going the wrong way. You asshole! Oh, I did 25. What did I get? Hopefully a lot of money. Holy freaking shit crackers. That's a lot of money. Alright, here we are. Meeting with Mirabeau. Uh-oh. Alright, let's get this over with. Speak to Mirabeau. He's upstairs. I don't know, something doesn't feel right about this. I don't know why, but it just doesn't. It just doesn't. Elise? Monsieur Mirabeau? Something really doesn't feel right about this. Hello? Whoosh. Okay. I've been wandering around Paris enough to know that when the real Mirabeau actually died, he was buried at the Pantheon for a while until they found out about his allegiance or whatever, and then they moved him. And there we go. I thought so. What is this? I found him like this. I didn't. Of course not. But I have to report this to the council immediately. They'll know what to do. No! So that's what Germain was don't doing, trust probably. Me as it is. I'll be the suspect first and last. Good you're right. Point. Of course, you're right. What are we going to do? We find out what happened. They did say that the blade was poisoned. God damn. Crime scene. All right. Oh, yeah, he was poisoned. He had to have been. Oh, wow. I knew it. What is that? It's, it's the weapon that kills your father. The weapon oh, that shit! Your father. That's a Templar badge of office. Jinx! What's it doing here? Painting a picture. You did say it was poisoned. Did I not say? That's gotta have something to do with this. Wow. Templar pin. Let me just go ahead. Templar badge of office that pulls double duty as a murder weapon. <laughs> yeah. Could talk with Elise. What is with the muttering? Shut up! Thank you. Oh. Poison. Uh, well, it wasn't Let's exactly what that. I was thinking, but poison! <laughs> Aconite. Hard to detect unless you know what you're looking for. Popular with Templars, is it? With anyone who wants to get away with murder. But yes. All right then. Poisoned wine glass. This glass contains residue of aconite, a poison often used by Templars. I'm not gonna accuse Elise! <laughs> Why would I do that? <sighs> oh, book. Book, 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 book. Looks like he was expecting a visitor. Who? Master Kamar. Over that way. Mirabeau's appointment book. An appointment book showing that Mirabeau had a meeting with Master Kimar. 
speak to Master Kemma. All right, Elise, I'll be right back. You stay here and please don't touch anything. It's a crime scene. Okay. Jesus, frame rate. I do better parkour when there's frame rate issues. Get down, damn it! Oh, Master Kemar! <gasps> Wait! I know that. I know that. They said that when I brought Elise in there. It's one of the dudes. Masters. Duh. Why didn't I piece that together earlier? Probably because I'm losing my mind! This is getting so interesting. <laughs> oh my god. But yeah, he's eventually buried in the Pantheon. And then they find out, like, his allegiance with France or whatever, or something. And they were like, no, he doesn't belong here, he's not worthy, and so they moved his body. I don't know where. I don't think- does anyone know where? I'm not sure where they buried him after that. Oh, no. Hello! Still give you a friendly greeting, even under such dire circumstances. I wonder if these guys know. Okay, I'm gonna be watching Master Kemar very carefully. I'm just gonna pretend this is L.A. Noir. Hey, Guillaume. Oh no, no, you're Kemar. Just kidding. God damn it. Ah, These names! Thank you, Dorian. What can I do for you? Mirabeau is dead. Dead? Murdered. I knew this truce would come to a bad end. I'll have to summon the rest of the council to deal with this. Elise had nothing to do with it. I'll stake my life on that fact. Please, give me a little more time. I'll find the killer. Very well. You have until tomorrow morning. No later. Mirabeau was poisoned with aconite. Poison? Do I need to point out that that particular strain is a favorite of the temple? No, you do I'm not. Aware. Where might one acquire aconite in such strong concentrations? Any doctor could prescribe it in diluted form. I myself take a tincture of aconite for my heart. It's strictly regulated, of course. But I do know of an apothecary in Lamare who is willing to overlook such petty legal matters. Thank you. In strong enough doses, that which cures can kill. Leonardo da Vinci! Master Kemar knows of a shifty apothecary that specializes in backroom deals. I believe he just said that, but... <laughs> Way to give it in summary to the people who refuse to pay attention to dialogue. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to the apothecary. Hello, sir. Everything alright, my friend? No, everything is not alright, as a matter of fact, but thanks for asking. I'm out of here. Out of here. Yes. Very nice. Whoa! Hey, wait a minute. Way to spoil the fun! Asshole! Chicken! He's right around this corner and around the other corner. Thought you might need some help. What? I think I can handle a lone druggist. Oh, hi! So Billy's. I don't entirely trust you, I just wanna say. You know what? I forgive you kiss. There we go. I forgive you. Okay, let's go. <laughs> hey, asshole! Bonsoir. I wonder Shit. if you might answer. Not again! Well played. What? Hey, damn you, come back here! <laughs> damn you, come back here! Who do you think I am? I mean, I'm, the hood is rather sinister, I understand, but... What do you think I'm gonna do to you? Ah, shit. Where are you going? Lifts use one, pass over under objects five. <laughs> I just have a few questions. I've been tailing this guy for a while. What the hell? What just happened to my game? Oh, I see what's going on. Optional objectives, but I don't freaking care. I caught him. <laughs> oh, please! I've never told anyone. I did just as you said. What are you talking about? You, you're with the other one, aren't you? The hooded man. Tell me about this other one. Jermaine. Who is he? I don't know. I never saw his face. Ah! He threatened to kill me if I didn't give him the poison. 
I didn't ask questions. I keep only a small quantity in stock. He took that straight away, but he told me where to drop off the second dose. And where would that second dose? Here. That's all I know. I swear it. He's planning to poison somebody else? Go on, then. Think of this as a wonderful story to frighten your grandchildren with. Well? You were right. He gave our mysterious killer the poison. And he said the killer wore a hood like mine. Well, there are shades of grey in every good story. If we've been betrayed... Ha <laughs> <by laughs> ha! Ubisoft thing, knows that! ...why the killer tried to frame me. Here. This is where the apothecary delivered his wares. What are we waiting for? Let's go! <laughs> Oh, Mirabeau is dead. I feel like visiting the Pantheon ahead of time kind of gave that away, <laughs> but still. But eventually, uh, Voltaire and Victor Hugo were buried there as well, so very cool stuff. All right. I did tackle him, but I did zero of the optional objectives. Because I couldn't freaking do it. <laughs> I just wanted to catch him. Death of Mirabeau. Alright, let's go ahead and read about this. April 2nd, 1791. Honoré Gabriel Riquetti Mirabeau lay on his deathbed. The 42-year-old was exhausted from his excessive drinking and womanizing. Well then, <laughs> Mirabeau. Has anyone ever been so exhausted from womanizing that they have to go straight to their deathbed? I mean, that's actually quite impressive. I think I'd probably have been standing at the end of his bed as he went, applauding. <laughs> Mirabeau had been a double agent since the Estates General of 1789. He'd received money from Louis XVI in return for his advisory services, and to make sure that the revolution would never overthrow the monarchy. An impassioned speaker who was always willing to stand up to his enemies, his death caused a considerable amount of dismay in Paris. He was seen as a potential minister as well as a first-rate thinker. His ashes were later transferred to the Pantheon, and yet, a year later, in 1792, when an iron chest was discovered that the Tuileri... Tuileries Palace containing correspondence between Louis the Sixteenth and among others Mirabeau. The latter was immediately discredited and removed from the Pantheon. No matter where I look, it doesn't say where they moved him. They took him out, but where the frick did they go? But yeah, that was it. Like he had allies with Louis the Sixteenth, and you know Louis the Sixteenth was not the best king. He wasn't, and so they thought that that wasn't okay. So they took him out of the Pantheon. Shut up. Actually, now that, I, now that I'm thinking about it, I did download my exclusive pistol. So perhaps I could... Fuck. Oh, shoot. We're going in here? This fortress place? Am I mistaken in thinking that this is the place where the whole Jacques de Molay thing happened? Because it sure looks like it. It looks medieval enough, that's for sure. Oh, shoot. I've been here before. <laughs> The mission is get your arson gear. Don't ask questions, piss pot. The fountain, huh? How much you want to bet this is a secret entrance of some kind? Confrontation. Alright. Let's see what's going on. Let's bring this killer to justice! After I itch my forehead. Charming place. What do you hope to find here? Mirabeau's this killer? This is where the apothecary says he delivered the poison. I'm hoping I can pick up a trail and follow it back to the source. What if it's in the water? Pick up a trail. Are you a bloodhound now? Maybe. Something like that. <laughs> a little bit. Oh, it's in the water. I fucking knew it! Oh, it's not in the water. Okay, well, never mind then. Now I just feel foolish. <laughs> Let's follow it this way. Out over there. 